Hi guys, I'm Silver and welcome back to Life is Strange Episode 4. When we left off, we uh, returned to the real reality. The real reality. Okay, great. Anyway, <laughs> you guys know what I mean. Um, the alternate reality was really sad and I'm, I'm hoping that, uh, you know, it gets easier from here on out. That is I the gun. I still feel sketchy about giving Chloe the gun back. Um, so, okay guys. I, I got something spoiled for me in the comments. Uh, I'm not going to say what because I don't want to spoil it for anybody else that's watching this for the first time and hasn't played it. But uh, I just wanted to say, please, if you if I have not posted the final episode of a game, um, do not post spoilers. Ideally, don't po post spoilers at all, um, especially in the comments of another video. I mean, if it's in the comments of the correct video, at least people could avoid it in case there was spoilers. But, um, yeah, yeah, don't do that. It's, uh, it was not fun to have a major thing spoiled for me before I got to experience it for myself. And the Tabanga is perhaps Arcadia Bay's oldest original totem. Chloe, I'm talking. <laughs> anyway, um, I think the person that did it had good intentions. I don't think there was malice there, so, um, yeah, I just figured I'd say something to avoid it in the future, hopefully. Anyway, let's, uh... Examine the shit out of this board. Did I look at everything? Should I look at everything? I looked at that and that and that. I guess I did. Yeah, I guess I did all. Did I look at this? Probably. Damn. This is a serious expose on the Prescotts. Finally. So. Anything else? Did I look at this? That's my Chloe. Okay, let's, uh, jump right in. I don't know. So close, yet so far away. We have to do three main things. Right. Uh, what things? One, decipher Frank's logbook. To get Nathan's phone to find out where he's been during the Vortex Club parties with Kate and Rachel. And see whatever hidden shit he's got in his messages. Three beats Step Douche Dan until he tells us about Frank, Nathan, and the Dark Room. And I do have a gun now. Keep it in your pants. <laughs> we'll have to do this on our own. Dude, at least let me kick his ass, then rewind. <sighs> Fine, whatevs. It's your power. Which I can't waste on shit like that. Or. Blackwell would be in big trouble. You didn't even let me take that money to pay Frank off. And I'm glad. We have to be better than that. I know. You should get busy in the garage to see what dirt you can dig up. I'm gonna cyberstalk some names and see where that leads. Or to who. And be careful of Stepcrack. He's not gonna be a happy camper after you reamed him yesterday and Mom is giving him the boot. I'm on it, partner. <laughs> I hope not taking I can't the abuse this level of my rewind power. It's way too dangerous and I Oops, I didn't know that would interrupt her. Oh no. Ah, oh, it's the bird. That poor little bird has been trapped in here. Anyway, um as I was saying, I hope not taking the money doesn't come back to bite me. Do I need to look at anything in here? Last time I wanted to splash some water on my face, my whole life changed. Oh, that blue dye makes me so happy. It means the real Chloe is back with me. Okay. Moving on. So I'm guessing... Okay, chill bird. I need to open this. There we go. Fly Why? free! Be free. <laughs> okay, we said basically the same thing. Jinx. If only I could jinx video Since games. Since David might be in there, I better mosey along for a change. 
Probably should close us. Okay. To the garage again. Uh oh. Sup, buddy. You won this battle, Max. You broke up my family. I salute you. David, I didn't try to hurt you. Ever. But I won't let anybody hurt Chloe. Too late, isn't it? You just better be damn careful with her. Don't you wander off into the dark. That went a lot better than I expected. Don't have human feelings. It's confusing. I think I'm supposed to hate you. Yo, yo, Max. Your friend Chloe texted me that I'm out of the loop now. She sounds hot, so I get why. Chloe actually texted you. I sure didn't have her number. At least I still get to go ape with you unless you want to chill with Chloe. Or we could all go. One pain in the ass is enough. Cool. I have to jet. Talk to you later. Alright. Let's, um... Man, I missed so many pictures. A note. Looks, Looks like, like David already booked a room. Am I supposed to feel bad? I'm just kind of glad that Joyce, uh... Got rid of him. Walk, Max. Thank you. Looks, Looks like, like they're back on the road to Paris. Ouch. David, do not be here when I get back from work. I mean it. Joyce. Oh. Those poor whales are like beached angels. What is going on here? Did I get everything? Did I actually cause that clock to stop? Oh, there's a ladybug stuck in the dials. Aw. Did it fly away? I wanted to say hi. Name. To think this all started with my vision of a tornado. Okay. Onto the garage. Never mind, there's something else. Joyce must be so upset. Are you helping anybody, Max? That's a fair question. It looks like David finished his car repairs. Maybe there's some new clues around. Should I have signed the petition? Blackwell sure isn't safe and private anymore. Despite our rather heated discussion about the successful petition to block a campus surveillance system, I am still interested in your feedback on other methods of, provide of improving Blackwell security. We must find a middle ground between safety and privacy for our students. Best, Principal Wells. Oh, meow, Miss Grant. Twist that knife. I didn't need a surveillance camera to see the suspension coming. <laughs> At least he has one weird fan. She's so sassy. Dear Mr. Madsen, I just wanted to let you know that I think it's bullshit what happened to you and the school has too many libtard metrosexuals who don't appreciate you or the military. I felt safe in my dorm where you were in charge, when you were in charge, and I thought about you protecting me. I hope you will come back to Blackwell and make sure we all are all safe at night. I am scared of this school. Alright guys, so my recording software has continued to crash over and over. I've tried to get uh, a little bit more recorded in Life is Strange, but it cut off here and um, 
yeah, I'm gonna end this part for right now and try and go fix whatever is wrong with <laughs> my recording software. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I will see you next time. Bye for now.